YouTube. So I haven't done a video in a while. Um, I've done a couple, but I haven't uploaded them. Just taking a break. Obviously I have a mess here, a lot of projects going on, but I got this and I was excited about it. It is the Orion D-Drive 2700 KV <clears throat> motor and ESC in one. Heard me right. Motor and ESC in the same package. Now, <clears throat> I'm gonna unbox this and then I'm gonna put it in my Viterra Twin Hammers because it's a really tight space in there. Um, so I think that's the best use case for it. It's also the only car I have that's running 2S battery. And as I've understand it, I haven't even opened it yet. But as I understand it, this is only 2S capable. So <coughs> let's open this guy up. Where's my knife at? There it is. They're gonna make it difficult. Pretty. Hey, what's that? Oh, I got stickers. All right. <clears throat> All right, here it is. Nothing else in the bowl. Oh, yeah, we got a product. Oh yeah, product manual, instructions, good to know. All right, so here we are. <clears throat> it's 540 can size. This one is a 2700 KV, um, 2700 KV. Bowser, shut up. 2700 KV motor. <clears throat> Ooh, it feels good. I gotta tell you, first impressions, the build quality on this thing is really, really nice. That is a lot of copper in there. So it's got these raised, it looks like it should dissipate heat really well, which seems to be everybody's concern with this motor. <clears throat> so anyways, here's the motor. I'm gonna grab the Viterra. Let me grab it real quick here, you can see. This is the Twin Hammers. Um, this guy here has a brush system in it. Only for the point of it's really, really fast and I don't want it fast. I wanted it slow, I wanted it to be a crawler. <clears throat> um, so this being a 2700 KV and only 2S, I think it'll meet my needs. And the space in here is extremely confined. So when I saw this motor, this is exactly what I thought about for it. <clears throat> so I'm gonna get to work, install this, and uh, we'll go from there. I'll give you a test run in just a minute. All right, so this is how this guy looks installed. Nice and pretty in there. I've got a very small, I think it's a 14 to 87. So this thing should be slow, but that's the point. I want this guy to crawl. It does look kind of empty in there. That's where my ESC used to be. So, and I got this crazy battery mount on the back. It mounts to the cage. But um, let's go test this, see how it works. So of course my dogs want to get involved in this. Bowser, move.
Hey. So it's a little jittery, super slow-mo, but it works. 